There's a lot of things that brought me into pediatric cardiology. Some of them are patient-centered, so I, I love seeing the patients. I'm also somebody that has a, a background in engineering, and so the concept of flows and pumps and resistance is something that I've always been interested in, and cardiology brings a lot of that technical aspect to my career. My name is Brian Birnbaum, and I'm a pediatric cardiologist here at Children's Mercy. Within pediatric cardiology, there's actually a lot of different things that we do. For me in particular, I manage heart failure patients, heart transplant patients, and pulmonary hypertension patients primarily. My approach to patient care really involves listening to what's going on with the patient and trying to get to the bottom of what is it the patients or the families want to know from the visitor, what do they need from the visit, and then to help educate them with my knowledge so that they have a better understanding of what is going on. We really value everybody's opinion and value the team approach, and so we're not gonna just talk amongst ourselves. We're gonna talk with whatever centers we need to talk with. We're gonna work together as a large team to do what's best for your child, no matter what it takes. One of the great things about pediatric cardiology is it's very technologically heavy, and we get to see a lot of technological advances, especially within the last 10 to 20 years within pediatric cardiology. And we're starting to see the ability to use devices and other innovations to be able to avoid surgeries and be able to avoid additional hospital stays. I think those technologies are gonna really grow in the next 10 to 20 years. And Children's Mercy is certainly at the forefront of being able to deliver those to our patients. I've had a number of patients that were very sick in the ICU, and several years later, you're out watching them play sports, do musicals, just being normal kids. And so being able to see kids that go from being really, really sick to kids that are really living normal lives is something that I find very inspiring.